What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's Destiny video I want to talk about the different additions you can get of the Taken King. Now I've had so many questions thrown at me on YouTube and on Twitter. A lot of people are confused about these and what you get etc etc. Hopefully in this video I will clear things up for you guys and we're going to start with the Taken King Legendary Edition. Now this will cost you $59.99, might as well call it $60. This will be available on disc and digital download and for your box here you get Destiny, the Dark Below, the House of Wolves and the Taken King. Now we're going to move on to the Collector's Edition. Now the Taken King Collector's Edition will cost you $79.99, we may as well call that $80. This version is only available on disc. The contents you can see on screen now is all what you will get with this. But I'll run you guys through exactly what you get anyway. You get Destiny, you get the Dark Below, you get the House of Wolves, you get the Taken King, you also get a Collector's Edition Steel Book Case, you also get some epic items, you get a Modified Treasure Island Book with intro letter from Cade 6, you get Cade 6 personal notes and illustrations, you get a collection of relics and artifacts and you also get a strange coin replica. You also get digital content which you must download with this actual collector's edition. Uh, you get three class specific emotes, you get three armor shaders, and you get three exotic class items with XP bonuses. You get all that for $80 or $79.99. Now we're gonna move on to the digital collector's edition. This also costing you $79.99 or $80. This is basically the same as the collector's edition, just digital. You don't get none of the items that you do get with the disc version. It's as simple as that. You get Destiny, you get the Dark Below, you get the House of Wolves, you get the Taken King, and you also get the three class specific emotes, you get the three armor shaders, and you also get the three exotic class items with XP bonuses, which you guys can see on screen now. Looking epic, by the way. We then have the digital download, which is $39.99 or $40. This is basically just the Taken King. And this is for all of us people who have been playing Destiny since basically the start. This is what we would purchase. With this, you also get VIP in-game rewards. You get a Sparrow, you get an Arm Shader, and you get a Year One Emblem, which I'll show you guys on screen now. Now, to qualify as a VIP player, you must own Destiny before the 31st of August 2015. Have a level 30 Guardian or have played The Dark Below and The House of Wolves before the 1st of February 2015 and then play any version of The Taken King. You don't technically need to have played Expansion 1 or 2 to be eligible for the VIP rewards. However, you will need to own these expansions to play The Taken King and you need The Taken King to acquire the VIP rewards. So basically, as long as you have one level 30 Guardian before the 31st of August 2015, you could purchase Expansion 1 and 2 after that date and still be good to go. So actually, you could be eligible for VIP rewards without all expansions, but you can't wear on or use VIP items without all expansions. I hope that makes sense to you guys. Now what people were complaining about, including me, is basically if you already own the House of Wolves, if you already own the Dark Below and Destiny and you've played the game since release, how do we get the exclusive digital downloads that come with the Collector's Edition? These are the three class specific emotes, the three armor shaders and the three exotic class items with XP bonuses. How do we get these? We've been playing since the start, we deserve to have these also and now thanks to Bungie we can actually purchase these in a separate package which will cost you $20. Yes, $20 which in my opinion is a little expensive for what you get and I'll talk about that in a second. But for this $20 you will get free class specific emotes, free armor shaders and free exotic class items with XP bonuses. So if you've already brought the digital download of the Taken King because you already own the Dark Below and the House of Wolves, you can purchase this for a further $20. Now more about the price, in my opinion $20 is a little high for free emotes, free shaders and free class items. I mean $20 is the price of the Dark Below, $20 is the price of the House of Wolves. Uh, they are DLCs, they are expansions, I mean I don't quite think these uh, shaders, armors and emotes quite add up to a whole DLC. But at the end of the day we do have a choice whether or not we purchase it. I know a lot of people won't be spending $20 
$20 on a few Emos class items and shaders. A lot of people think it's a little higher of a price for what you actually get. But like I said, at the end of the day, you do have a choice. Me personally, I'm going to my local game. I'm going to try, if they ain't run out of pre-orders, to buy the collector's edition. And that will be me getting the Dark Below, the House of Wolves again. I just want all that good shit. I just want them items. I want that damn strange coin. But that's just me. But guys, I hope this video clears things up for you who were a little confused. If you still have questions, ask them down below. I've got plenty of knowledgeable Destiny subscribers who I'm sure can answer your questions if I can't. Like I said, leave a comment down below if you still have something to ask. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Do drop a like. I do appreciate the support. Thanks for stopping by as always. And peace out until next time. Peace!